and DeWalt, Makita, Ryobi, Ridgey. Here at the Home Depot, it's August 2022, and we're in the storage section. Compartmentalized modular tool storage, but that's not what I really wanted to focus on. What I really wanted to focus on was a lot of the steel storage that's here that we're seeing pop up again. We have the 52 inch Tendor Mobile workbench with solid wood top at 648. Okay, here's the deal. It's the International, okay, it does have the slow close, but the best part is, is that, as you can see, we have multiple colors. We have orange, we have green, we have red, but the red happens to be from Husky, but if you did want white in the International, hello, Stephen Lee, how are you this evening, my friend? They also have, oh, this is also Husky, at $498. Hello, Randy. Matthews, we got Jay Rivas, the, the whatever, as long as it's not yellow. What if it is yellow? What if we had a little yellow? My point being that we have a hello, Wilmer's preacher, and Rick, we have a whole bunch of steel storage that's making its way back into the store. They also have, these are some of my favorites. I have cut quite a few of these. This is the one, two, three, four, five shelf, 900 wake, 9,000. Kind of weight capacity, Rapunzel, Rapunzel, let your hair down, at $349. I believe I paid $399 for these a while back. They're really, really sturdy, and they actually look pretty nice as well. I like that deal, but I know what you want to see. You want to see the powerful tool deals. Alex Smith says, what's up? Vegan cookies, good. That is what's up, my friend. Welcome to the stream. Let me see here. Make sure we're on the right mode. Smash the like button, says Andrew Withers and Gary. Hello. Hello, Jordan. How you doing? The Philippines is in the stream. I got to tell you, 90, 99 cents for two-inch string clamps. You can never have too many string clamps. Many, many functions. My favorite, of course, is on string lines. They have the Husky 15,000 pound, oh, it's 1,500 pound capacity. Portable workbench. Come with a couple clamps. I like that. 99 bucks. I will tell you, they have some M12 deals and some battery deals for M12. Two-pack shaker or 3.0s is 129 Problem is, is that they go on, they go on. But what's not gone is the three-piece pry bar set at 2997 I actually need one of these because we've been doing more mechanically inclined, heavy machinery work around the shop. Hello, Balaki. How you doing? Cincinnati, Ohio is in the stream. What they do have is the compact, M18 compact. This is brushed at 129. It's coming to 1.5 amp hour batteries, charger in a bag. You'll get a lot of work done with that. A lot of holes drilled, a lot of fastener set. One of my favorite things though here in the center of the floor is this shockwave bit set at 39.97. And you can see here, you're getting the quarter by quarter. This is the longer, I believe it's like six inch extension. We have the two inch quarter by quarter extension. Yo, Rapunzel ran a 5K with the tits today. Yo, God bless you, bro. I wish. I wish. I I I I'm, I gotta tell you, I'm like a 10 minute mile. <laughs> no good. We have the we have some nut setters. We have a quarter by three eighths adapter in there. We have some shockwave bits. This is a nice. You know what I like about this kit? Okay, hello lawn mower. It's 60 pieces, but you have a nice variety. This is a great starter set. Okay, you know the higher bit count kits are great if you already have the accessories but if you needed a starter kit this has a nice rounded variety of bits i like that they even have it looks like they have those double-sided bits in there whoa you can see them in here these are the two inch bits they have bits on both sides nice a lot of you have been asking some questions uh, about the availability of some tool brands here at the Home Depot. And we're only four minutes in. I could kind of address some of it if you'd like. Hello, Trinidad, how you doing? Hello from Wolverine, Michigan. What's up there, Cody? I will tell you, one of my favorite modular tool storage systems has definitely got to be the rigid because you have, you don't have all the bells and bobbles, but you do have good, sturdy, open boxes at a great price. They now have added this 27 uh, quart cooler, cold box, at $79.97. What's up, Chris, Chris Paul? That's right. It's Saturday Night of the Deeps. Here's the thing. 
If you wanted to find out more about that cooler box or cold box, go to this video right here. I gotta tell you, I think that they're rounding out that system and I like what I'm saying, sturdy. And you're getting, like if you don't need like soft side storage, but you need open toolboxes, hard side, it's a great, it's a great system. Just my opinion though. You'll see that uh, Mill A Wall K is doing some uh, linear edge deals here at the depot right now. Okay, hold dozer. We have some axe blades, and uh, you know they're a fair price. What I really like though is <laughs> Diablo, the fighting chicken. Here's the deal: a lot of people were concerned. Hello, George Bonnie and Crazy Bike. Wags, yo, what up, Wags? A lot of you were concerned that with the addition of X-Lock on grinders and wheels, would the price for the, the wheels themselves go up in price? And Diablo keeps on putting out de deals. I mean, if, if we did the, you're getting five discs, they say for the price of three. Here's the thing, 10 bucks. If we did the math on standard wheels, you'd probably find that these happen to be less expensive. And here's the deal, if you are, using grinder on a daily basis this is one of those times where you want to stock up on, on wheels it's not like it's not like you're like you see like the old little old lady in south philly that they go to the corner store and they get groceries just for that day to cook dinner well don't be like a little old lady from south philly i love them but here's the deal if you if you know you're going to be doing a bunch of that work throughout the year stock up on these now so you have them put them in your cupboard okay we could do the math. I don't think we need to. Hello, what's up, Chris R9? How you doing? What's up, Joshua? And Justin, how you doing? What's up, Wings and Pizza? How you doing? They also got some battery deals on door cell power boost. How, how could it boost power? Power boost ingredients? That can't be real. Maybe it is. What's up with this? Is this actually candy? That's some crazy stuff. You'll see 1787 for an 18 pack of either double A AA or triple A. Hello, Daniel, you, how are you? They got some Dremel deals, Dremel, Dremel. This is the 12 volt max rotary tool for 99 bucks. Or they have the four volt rotary tool for 59.97. Pretty funny. They have some other steel storage here. I gotta tell you, this doesn't look like anything I've seen before. This might be a new addition. It's got the little, the, the hydraulic lift cylinders. I like the coating on this, 598. I actually need a cart for the back of the shop for hand tools at this point. I like this. They have extension cord deals, 2498, lighted end, 14.3, 50 footer, not bad. We have the remnants of some uh, Milwaukee deals here. Now he wants to eat batteries. No, they're not. How do you know they're not candy, bro? It says it says ingredients. I mean, what would you think? I don't know. It says ingredients. I don't know what that means. You can see they have the remnants of a, of a former deal out here, but plenty of bare tools. They have one-hand recip saws. They have the Milwaukee router. We have some more linear edge from Diablo. Two-pack shakers. I like these deals. This is another one. This is this is one like these are deals that you're gonna want to if you know you're gonna need them I would stock up on them now If you're gonna use them throughout the year New York m18 battery deals. I don't know if they're having battery deals in in New York I'm sure but I'm it is kind of regional $12.97 for the 16 foot compact tape measure or The uh, fastback from Milwaukee with with blade storage. I like that What's up, Blackie Johnson? Mr. and Mrs. Kia. What's up, Kia's? But the Mrs. is not home uh, here. She is She is at a charity function. She's always, like, uh, volunteering her time, uh, whether it's serving food or whatever it may be. But, uh, you know, she's a, she's a good soul. I'm a very fortunate per human being to have such a loving wife, such a good person, always trying to sh always do, do something to give back. I bought an M12 barrel grip jigsaw. M12, 
Two amp hour battery free. They sent me two batteries. Score. Yo, listen, bro. I, that's, that's here. Here's the deal. If they send it to you, maybe they're maybe they're trying to get rid of it, cuz. But good on you for scoring. They have a two pack shaker, fifty four ninety seven for a twelve inch, forty four Tefus's general purpose saw blades, or forty seven ninety seven on the ten inch. So let's see what else is going on here. It looks as though Skater is is has there's some M cap. I don't know if they're. What what was up with the full size cooler at Milwaukee event? So Balaki, here's the deal. I'll answer that. It's a great question. What's up, Chef Doc and Jason Babil? That's real nice. Like, good evening. How you doing, Jason? Hello, Justin Malinowski. Justin Malinowski. It looks like Justin Malinowski don't like the new belt sander. What's up, pork chops, sandwiches? Hey, it's always a good day. To see. Yes, that's right. You tell him there. Solid coal. Now, here's the thing. If you wanted to find out about the cooler as much as I know about it, go to that video here. I don't think I could actually link uh, a short, but if you were to check out some of our shorts, you'd see that they had the full-size cooler. I could check here in store if they have it. I will tell you they had plenty of coolers at the Milwaukee Pipeline event. Um, and it's crazy. Like, they had dozens of them there at every tent. And it was it was only 85 degrees, but it was really, really hot out there. So it's good that they had cold beverages, like high-quality H2O. But here's the thing. I don't know what the holdup is in store and such for the cooler. That's all I can really tell you about it. I mean, it did a good job as a cooler. Capacity seemed big relative for its size. Uh, that's all I really know about it to be honest with you. that I just happened to, to see that the coolers were there. I knew you'd all appreciate seeing them, so I, I put it in a short. But that was about the extent of it. So Makita, for $349, has their, their top-of-the-line hammer drill and impact driver. It's come with two 5-amp-hour batteries. Some of you might let me know uh, if there's an additional deal that's going on. I'm just not seeing it on the signage here at the store. They have their compact hammer drill and impact driver at $249. That's coming two 4-amp-hour batteries. That's more like a mechanic's car. La mower, that's exactly what it's like. So Wags Davison says, less and less the wall at the, the depot. So we'll come back to, that was a pretty good, that was a pretty good question. And here's the thing, you, you, you really, like, I think that, I think that, I think that um, we kind of discussed this previously in previous videos and what was going on for tool deals and such, but you'll see here on the end cap, 1367, they have a 30 piece max fit bit set. Okay, as we walk down the aisle here, you will see that they have a whole ton of DeWalt Tough System 2.0, as well as roller boxes. Okay, we'll see Stanley products. We see a ton of DeWalt hand tools. Okay, and the reason I'm going through this is because I've, I've been getting more and more questions about this in the comments and on social media. You could see a whole bunch of new hand tools. These are Tough Series hand tools. If we if we move down if we move down the saw aisle, okay, you'll see we have the wall organizers. Love these organizers. I will tell you this much: these are <laughs> at now at twenty three ninety eight. When we bought them, they were at twenty bucks. We saw them go down to fifteen bucks during the holidays. They were were ten dollars. Okay, I would I would suggest if you don't need them right now, wait until maybe the holidays. Maybe you could score them at ten bucks, but. They are they are definitely up in price at twenty three ninety eight. I would hold off if you can. Could Chaka Gillis? We appreciate that two dollar holla. He says good evening, Vinny. Ryobi tools are trash. I uh, listen. There's a whole bunch of Ryobi here. Chaka Gillis, we appreciate that twenty dollar holler. Thank you so much. We don't necessarily agree with Chaka Gillis that all Ryobi tools are trash. We think that there's are there have been situations where some Ryobi tools have been trash, but. I think that they're making great strides recently. Uh, you know, as of late, you can't take away that they do have one of the most expansive 18 volt platforms that are has been back forwards and backwards compatible for a lot of years. They're great for homeowners and DIYers, but even some professionals use Ryobi tools. Okay, Chaka Gills doesn't happen to like them, and we appreciate his right to share his opinion. And thank you for that twenty dollar holler. Now back to. Back to the DeWalt thing. We, we see that they have their double bevel. It's non-slider. We have their 10-inch non-slider. I think that right now uh, we did a video about why those might not be in the store. You can go right here. 
and, and check that video out. We'll explain, pretty much explain why you're not seeing that saw in the store. Do you see dust? Do you use dust collection on your saws? If so, what adapter do you use? I, I will, I will a lot of times put like, um, I will try to attach a hose when I can and, and box in the saw when we set it up. I, I really like, when you start to, when you're younger, when I was younger, I figured out oh, we'd come back and clean it up. Oh, you know, you, you, you know, but the, the reality is, is that I try to mitigate as much as that up front as I can, because I, I, I don't, I don't want an airborne, especially in the places that we're working. Most of the time I'll try to set up outside. So if we're in high rise or, or in commercial settings where getting outside is, is, would be too much, then I don't even bother, but then we set it up to mitigate those issues. So yes, I try to use dust collection as much as possible when possible. We're going to, we're going to move down. Hello, Larry Cook. How are you doing? Let's move down. Now, as you can see, if we move through the powerful tools. You'll see they're, they're loaded up new XR. Uh, drill driver, hammer drill. We have the new atomic impact drivers. Uh, I will let you know, they also have the compact uh, atomic full size 996. We have some other new offerings here as well. Throw them atomic. Here's the deal. And we have their you know standard drill, drills and, and, and screw uh, drywall uh, screwdrivers. Here's the thing. We talked about this not that long ago okay when 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 you, this is pretty much the footprint that the wall pretty much had when we've seen all the spaces where they are even their lighting solutions and such the supply chain i mean even their drill bits and such the supply because of supply chain issues i don't i don't know if i'm giving you like for some of you i guess i am what's up christopher here's the thing I don't know if you're aware of this or not, but these end caps where, where you're seeing like Makita, you're seeing like Milwaukee on the end caps, they literally pay space to be on these end caps. Okay. Now here's the deal with that being said, if, and I know, you know, we talked about this, the wall especially decided that they were they were short on supply chain that they were not going to be doing any tool deals okay until until we got to fourth quarter they were going to skip third quarter so instead of they're not going to pay for end cap space <laughs> to not sell anything they don't have anything to put on promo so they just maintained in their normal spaces throughout the store and it allowed milwaukee to go hog wild and take up more, I don't know if in this location they've taken up more space than usual, but so here's the deal. That's why you feel like you're not seeing as much the wall. It's just that they're not running the promos that they have ran previously because they went so crazy uh, earlier in the year, especially right after the beginning of the year. Mr. Robert Banks with a $50 holiday. It's good to see you, my friend. Thank you. I hope you're doing well. We appreciate that. So it's not that they're going anywhere. It's just that they're not promoting any crazy tool deals at the moment. Milwaukee is running some promos and here's the deal. It seems as though they're already moving through some of their other, you know, some of their combo kits. Mr. Robert Bates going nuts. Hello, how you doing my friend? Thank you so much. Let's go through their deals that they're running presently, okay? If you buy any one of these, so you have their, their one inch rotary hammer, their recip saw, their circular saw, you're gonna get a free XC 6.0. If you buy any one of these uh, M18 deals right here in this price category, whether it be that tool tool combo kit, okay? Cirque saw and their brushless hammer drill, 299. You got the light charger. I think this is a great pack out uh, accessory. It's a light charger, so you have three independent heads, charges your battery as, you, as it's plugged in, or it can run on a battery, $199. I will tell you, they're, they're grinders and, they're, and this vacuum, especially not my favorite tools, definitely not my favorite tools. You're gonna to get an XC 5.0 for free. And as we round them out, we have their, their, 
lower end deal. When I say lower end, I'm just saying in price, price, price wise, you have their combo kits, you have their 169 is for the bear tool surge, oscillating multi-tool or their one handed resips all 159. You're going to get an a 2.0 battery. Thank you, Mr. Robert Bates. When we talk about somebody making an, an entrance. Thank you, sir. We appreciate all the help with the channel. So that's what's going on power tool wise. What I really like to see, what I really like to see, what's the paper coming, covering up, says Woodchuck. Uh, I believe uh, if my memory serves me correctly, that is the, the combo kit, a uh, Gen 3 hammer drill and impact driver. Correct me if I'm wrong, chat, let me know. We really appreciate the help, Mr. Rob Bates. It's great to see you. I ho hope you'll let everybody know in the chat because everybody asked for you uh, how you're doing and all. Please let everybody know how you're doing, how you're feeling. I, I believe that uh, from the last time we've spoken, you're doing a lot better and you're enjoying your you're you're enjoying time time this summer vacationing or whatever it may be. Just enjoying life and we appreciate that. We know you had gone through a, a whole bunch uh, where you weren't feeling so well. I don't know how, my, how much I'm supposed to say or not say, so I don't want to spill the beans. Mr. Robert Bates, thank you so much. What I really like seeing here is the, the tool accessories here on the end cap. And they do have some recip saw deals. Picked up the Super Saws off for 149 Gen 4 hammer drill for 110 and the 6-inch braking grind and paddle switch for 138 Yo, what's up, Milwaukee? Yo, you made, you made it short, Milwaukee. So you know. This is nice. I like it. It comes with a little case here. You're getting 13, 13 pieces. Includes a torch. But I do, I really see some of my real favorites. But uh, Jonathan Page, what's up, Cosbo? Uh, anyone else have multiple grinders to avoid swapping this? I will tell you this much, Lawnmower. Mr. Robert Bates, thank you so much. I, I will be honest with you. There was a time. But now, oh, we appreciate that crazy Mike. Mike crazy Mike says... It doesn't cost you a dime to slash, smash the like button an, an odd number of times. We appreciate that. Listen, if you if you wanted to help out a channel, the channel for free, a free way to help out in a big way would be to close the chat for just a second and smash the like button. It's free for you to do. It doesn't cost you a dime. Plus, you get seven years of good luck. It really helps out. Thank you so much. I mean, there's over 500 people here, and there's only 100 and something likes. Come on, help a brother out. I like all the tool accessories I'm seeing here. Now they have the 10-inch, uh, I'm sorry, the 10-piece bimetal wholesale kit. We went over this one previously. What's good about this is you're actually getting five wholesales. Like a hurricane, that's right. You're getting five wholesales, one inch, one inch and an eighth, inch and a half, two inch, and two and three quarters. You are getting three pilot bits and two arbors with this kit. So it's five pieces that are not actually wholesales. 39.88. Hello, New Brunswick. What's up, Raul? How you doing? It comes with order bottle. They wouldn't probably wouldn't mind if you took it with you. I like that. What I really like though is these impact sockets. Deep well impact sockets at 65 bucks. This is and a lot of people think that it is a plastic rail. This is actually a metal rail with ends. And look at the sizes. Half inch all the way up to a full one inch impact socket. These are gar lifetime guarantee. This this is a nice, nice set. I will let everybody know that it would be great to see it in metric here in the store. I would like to see it, but maybe maybe we could find it somewhere else. But I like that we're seeing more of these accessories to go with the rest of the tools a lot. Thank you, everybody. We're up over 200 likes. We appreciate that. See, that didn't hurt a bit. You ain't kidding. I have way too many tools. They are starting to t overtake my house. Well, I don't know what to tell you. Come on, people, smack. That's right, Chaka, you tell them. Now, time and time, Joshua Delgato. Hey, Vince, what do you think about the Milwaukee new blower? I think we, we have like a whole video about it. J Joshua D Delgato. Haven't seen a, a tool deal. Date tool from Home Depot. Be coming up soon. I don't know Adidas. I gotta tell you. So here's the deal. I, I could link you to the video about the about the blower right here. I'll give you the I'll give you the short version. Go check out the blower video if you want to see here in depth. Here here's the deal with the blower. I think that for some people, it will make a hundred percent sense. 
I think that uh, for people that don't want to move off of, thank you, Blocky Johnson. I think that for people that don't want to move off the, the Milwaukee platform and they need a more powerful leaf blower, I think it makes some sense. But with so many options out there, I think that you can get the, the leading brand in outdoor power equipment. You can get a blower that's more powerful with a battery, with a charger, for cheaper than you would pay bare tool for the Milwaukee. And it gets, it gets to be a, a tough proposition for Milwaukee Tool. And I think that I could say that all day, but if Milwaukee Tool is moving the units, then it doesn't really matter what I say. That's just one person's opinion. Okay, but I think that me, oh, he's eating Korean food. I love Korean. Korean barbecue is one of my favorites. A lot of flavors. Here's the thing. If they're moving the units, it doesn't matter what I say. But the, the reality is, is that I look out for all of you. Okay, and I think that there are sometimes better options. It, it, sometimes it just listen. Here's the deal: when Makita, when Makita was running circular salt deals, okay, that included like four of their batteries with their rear handle saw, and it was cheaper. Batter, four batteries, a charger, the saw. It's a very good saw. When when they were running that deal, and it was cheaper than Milwaukee's bare tool. Hey, I was like, yo, sometimes you have to just put the extra charger on. You have to put it on the truck. I'm sorry. Let me see here. Stephen Lee has a question. Are there any recalls or, or unusual mechanical issues with the Milwaukee 18 volt Super Sozol? A local deal in my area is disgusting. Is disgusting. Oh, disg dissuading contractors from buying them? My run's great. Listen, I've Super Sozol is, is super awesome. I, I don't know if... And, and they buy into those deals, I, I, there wouldn't be any good reason for them to dissuade people from buying them. That doesn't quite make any sense, Stephen Lee. I will tell you, it's it's an awesome Sawzall. It really is. Now, here's the deal. You know, if you're, if you're demoing, and you're like, let's just say you're doing flood cuts, like we do. Uh, sometimes, it can be if you're if you're using it all day you might want to just go with the standard fuel but if you're if you need to make fast cuts through wood especially put on orbital action it's unbelievable or if you're going straight downward through steel and such super saw is always, is a great it's a great saw you'll see that there is no signage here on the on the end cap for makita except for the sign but there are a whole bunch of tools one of my favorite would be this this X lock grinder at 199. Here's the deal. Go watch this video. If you don't believe in X lock yet, I'm telling you, it, it is like it is so beneficial to be using, and I just believe that. Okay, Makita is not my main. It's not my main platform, but I will tell you when I'm grabbing for a grinder, this is the grinder that I grab for because it's so easily wheels are so easily swapped out, and you know I'm not working on a, on a bench all day where I have multiple grinders set up. I, I prefer a cordless grinder for convenience, and I prefer having one of them. I can't have six of them. So that's just my preference. You'll see they have some other bare tools here as well, including that rear handle saw from Makeda. Let me see if there's any, what other questions do you have? Remember, type at VCG Construction. It helps me see your comment, and I can answer the question because I'm, I'm all alone once again. Completely agree. The brand that, that we shall not name sells their top lower with battery and charge for $2.99. Who, who's the brand we, might, we shall not mention? I will say, if you buy any one of these tools, from Milwaukee in the M12 platform, you're gonna get a free CP 2.0. I will tell you that for some of you that are, you were talking about that jigsaw earlier, the barrel grip. I don't know if I would necessarily call it a barrel grip, but um, it does offer some pretty good control. I, I grab here, here. You could grab here and here with, with two, like here with, I grab here with my right and guide with my, my left up top. Is it money maker of a saw at 99 bucks? I will be honest, I wouldn't mind seeing a fuel. I, I would assume that it's coming soon. Coming soon to a store near you. I'm gonna move down the aisle real quickly for multiple reasons. The polisher. But I wanna see 
uh, if if the Super Souls all is here. I'm just curious. So we could see that fuel souls all, not seeing super souls all, and um, I don't know. Maybe there is something going on, Stephen Lee. That's odd, Stephen Lee. Now that you mention it, maybe you're on to something, my friend. Listen, here's the deal. I don't think that there's anything wrong. I think that maybe they're just moving out inventory. Maybe that's on the horizon for an up, uh, for a refresh. Or maybe the depot just moved it out for now. And they're going to, they're just, you know, restocking their inventory. Sometimes they'll, they'll move out inventory for, for, for no un, for no, what seems to be no good reason. But, uh, yeah, I'm not seeing it here. I will, I will tell you, I like the compact Starlock from Akita. 229 home bear tool though. I've been holding off. I should have got it when it was on deal, but I didn't. Completely agree. The brand. Oh, wow. That's crazy. Yo, did, did I get disconnected? I feel like, I feel like we have no, no new comments. I'm disconnected. Oh my God. I feel so disconnected from all of you. Somebody say something, please. Let me know you're still here. A lot of you asked if, uh, I was over here a minute ago. A lot of you asked if Rigid was leaving the Home Depot. I, I, I found it odd, being that Rigid is literally, their, their power tools are like a Home Depot exclusive brand. Like you really can't, you can't find these anywhere except for direct tools and the Home Depot. No, Ridge is not going anywhere. Matter of fact, they've been doing crazier and crazier deals trying to get to win back your trust, which, which I, I, you know, look, I think that they've made some missteps in the past and they're, and they're trying to win you back. Win you back. Don't know what you got till it's gone in this location. They actually do have, in other locations, we saw the Rigid Palm Router. It was a, uh, an Octane. This one's the brushless here. More and more stuff. I will tell you, one-handed resip saw. If you wanted to see it in action, go to this video right here. I don't know what happened to everyone. Let's see. Let's go to live chat. Ooh, look at that. Stephen Lee with a fight out hall. The deal dealer was discouraging contractors from buying it. I love the ones I have. Thanks, Vince. No problem, Stephen Lee. Listen, I, I don't know what the deal is. I, I will tell you this. I'm not seeing it here, Stephen. Listen, I don't know if this is true. This is purely speculation on my end. Maybe they know there's 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 a shortage of them and they want to keep them in because they, they feel like they're gonna be able to increase the price down the road. I don't know, dude. Like, what was the price they were charging? Speaking of Rio, where's Chaka Gala? Speaking of Ryobi, they have their deal running. This just went up on August 1st, and it will be running for a while. They're doing free battery or starter kit. So you can get a two pack, a two amp hour. Those are their HP batteries. Comes with a nice little, excuse me, fuel gauge on it. You can get that for free, or you can get a free two amp hour starter kit means you're gonna get a single battery and a charger. That is not an HP battery. If you buy any one of these tools, I think it's a little, I'm just being honest with you, I think it's a little lame <laughs> that you are buying that whole kit at $2.99 and you're getting the same choice as if, if somebody like bought one impact wrench. But that's just me. Look for a Milwaukee Recip Saw hack. Saw? Already dead. Milwaukee, wow, Vince, they got some pipes. You got some pipes on you. Oh my God, I gotta be careful. I sing so well that what will happen is I might get a, a copyright notice from for singing the song. I, I, I shouldn't sing because I just sing so well. People think that I'm, it's like the actual singer. And what happens is uh, I have to split. I have to like, they'll, they'll, they'll copyright the video. It's bizarre because I, just because I sing so well, I want to just take a look at outdoor power equipment. I want to see if they actually added 
any of the, the new offerings that we saw. Because some of the offerings that we saw at Pipeline, if you wanted to see the, the, the live stream, you could go to this video here. Some of those offerings that we saw at Pipeline had been out for a while. Like we've seen, we're like we, we, we announced those like months ago. So I wanted to see if maybe they're here yet, but Ryobi has some other deals here on the end. Some exclusives on their cordless leaf blowers, string trimmers, and their sp their cordless sprayer, easy clean power t power cleaner, ninety nine bucks. It's it's tool only. Uberman, I am an Uberman, but I I do like Uber. I like Uber. That's a great invention. Let's take a look, real, real. Let's take a look real quickly. Hello, Samuel Adams. Oh, one of our founding fathers has entered the stream. It is great to have you. One year I got the fuel resip one hander for pruning with two pack battery. There's nothing wrong with that. Just got the Milwaukee seven and a quarter motor saw with some good blades for it. Diablo. Diablo. So I wanted to see what they have going on here. So this is the this is the M18 hedge trimmer tool only. 24 inch. Here, here's my question. That's the 16 inch chainsaw. Is this the same hedge trimmer or is that a Gen 2? I'm, I'm just kind of confused at 199. Okay. I'm okay. The one thing I haven't seen in store recently. I don't think I've I hope you're having it. Thank you, Warren Bun. The one thing I haven't seen in store. I'm looking forward to the, to the Halloween decorations, to be honest with you. So the one thing I've not seen in store at the at the deeps is the Milwaukee lawnmower. We've seen the DeWalt self-propelled with their with their batteries. I mean, they offer a lot of value if you think about it. Like for instance, this this 21 and a half inch mower is coming with two 10 amp hour batteries, two chargers, plus the mower, and it's only $499. Now, I've not used it. I don't know what kind of cut quality it gives you. It is a push. It's not self-propelled. If you wanted self-propelled, it would be an additional $100. But think, of, think about it. Think about it. That's a lot of value. Here's the deal. Even at $599, even at $5.99, this is coming with those two 10 amp hour batteries. Milwaukee's come with 12. Okay, but think about it. You're you're still, I'm gonna say $500 cheaper because I believe the, the Milwaukee mower at this point is $1,100. This thing ha does have a steel deck and all. And I've never, I've never seen, plus one, Milwaukee says on the Diablo. So my, my thing is, is that, is that, I think you could look at it two ways. Number one, you, you have to say to yourself, like, did, did Milwaukee come up with that mower just to, to get, to, to wring every, every dollar out of its users? Like, do they know that Milwaukee, Milwaukee users will buy that mower? And I think the answer is yes. But here's here's my point. My point is is that you asked for it, they delivered. That was my that's my point. I don't think it's a bad thing that they charge what they charge. I feel like they made it in a limited amount of numbers, so they had to charge the price that they charged, and it is what it is. It is what it is. I don't think it's a bad thing. I think you can get more bang for your buck with with other maybe some other brands, but some of you just don't want to move off that platform and i can understand just being wanting to be on one battery platform give it a year this is the thing i i i, I can't pronounce your name but the point my point is is that they made it in such limited numbers i think it's already sold out in a lot of places i don't even know if you can get it i love clearance in this store they always have like good stuff i had to check it Switches, decor plates, outlets. Yo! I love it. Only 206. La, 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 la. 
How is the Ryobi mower? I don't, I don't know. I haven't used the BB. I got to be honest with you. I, I have no real feedback. I will tell you that um, I know there are a few other people that actually use the mower and they, and they really like it. But I, I, I honestly don't know. Can someone recommend a good laser for carpentry? I think Milwaukee makes a good at their M12 laser is great. I think that Bosch would, would serve you well. Some people use the older DeWalt's, but uh, I think you couldn't go wrong with any one of those brands. I want to say a special thank you to those of you that have monetarily contributed to the stream because Verizon does not let us stream for free. They're not down with tool deals. I don't know why. I think they would be, it would be great if they were, but they're not. Let me see here. Did you get a chance to try out the new M12 pruner shear at Pipeline? I did, in fact, have a chance to use the new pruner shear at the Pipeline. I think it was nice. I'm going to be honest with you. It's also one of those tools where people are on a platform. They don't want to leave that platform because here's the deal. Ryobi has a very similar shear. So it's one of them things. And you have to ask yourself, that shear is $199 bare tool. Could you get the Ryobi shear plus the battery plus the charger for the same price? Do you follow what I'm saying? You, you have to, I don't know, you have to weigh it, weigh it all. You have to weigh it all. I want to say a special thank you to those of you who have monetarily contributed to the stream. Appreciate it very much. It's very humbling to have people believe in what you're doing and want to help out and contribute to the channel. It means a lot to me. I appreciate it. Thank you so much to all of you. Chaka Gillis, Think Crazy Mike, uh, Stephen Lee, Mr. Robert Bates. Let me see if I can scroll back because it, it, it doesn't tell me anymore when I, when, I, when I go on, but I will scroll. No, nah, it won't let me go back that far. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Also want to say thank you to the moderators for being here, helping to keep the chat G, chat G rated because everybody knows that the best way to get from A to Z is to keep it VCG rated. And finally, see you, Jim. I want to say a special thank you to each. You have a great weekend, Larry Cook. You don't tell me what to do. <laughs> I appreciate all of you. Listen, Saturday night, you know, I hope you had a great day, but I hope you have a great night as well. If you're drinking, don't drive. And if you're driving, don't drink. Go out, make a friend. Tomorrow is Sunday. Invite somebody over for dinner. That, that you maybe met tonight, had a drink with, or bought a cup of coffee for, because we are all better together. We're more stronger, we're better together. And you'll find, if you just get out of your comfort zone and talk to somebody that you might not think you had anything in common with, you probably do. You probably have more in common with those people. They probably just wanna be happy, provide for their family, you know, you know, complete a better job, just contribute. And guess what? It's it's when you get to when you get around more people like us and you, you'll realize that we're not alone. I want to say thank you to Christopher Johnson for the thirty dollar holiday. Thank you so much, everybody. I hope to see you all on the next one, like tomorrow. And if you want to see a video tomorrow, leave it down in the comment section below. I have one all ready to go. I'm super excited about. It. You're gonna to want to have this. If you want to see it, you gotta let me know. Everybody, have a good night. Be safe out there. Appreciate every single one of you. All righty then. I think we all do have a Milwaukee tool addiction, pretty much. The Disco Inferno says, let's see it, bro. Don't make me pull out my best Travolta moves.